Atlanta, Georgia, European Tour Rookie of the Year certainly John Rahm has set his sights on becoming only the second Spaniard after the late great Seve Ballesteros to capture the European Tour No. 1 crown. Ballesteros won the then-named European Tour Order of Merit title on six occasions 1976-78, 1986, 1988 and 1991. And in the intervening 26 years no Spaniard, including double Masters winning Jose Maria Olazabal, or current Masters champion Sergio Garcia, has managed to duplicate Seve's effort. With nine events, including this week's Portugal Masters, remaining on the 2017 race to Dubai schedule Rahm is lying third and trailing Euro 38,000 behind compatriot Garcia, but also 1 million in 10 Euro adrift of the front-running Tommy Fleetwood. Seve Ballesteros, a six-time European number one and still the only Spaniard to become number one in Europe. It would something outstanding, something beyond belief, but in Europe it would be a little more special, just because the last Spaniard to be number one in Europe was Seve Ballesteros, said Rom. Not Sergio, not Elizabeth have been able to do it. So if I ever get to do it, it will be a really special moment. But if I get to do it in my rookie year, yeah, that'll be, I mean, I can't explain it. I can't explain what winning any of this will feel, because it's something so different than what we play for usually. And as a rookie, just I can't, to be honest, I still can't fathom winning any of those things because it's so, so special. However, Rom confirmed on the eve of the Tour Championship he will commit to just three of the eight remaining eight European Tour events he could enter. John Rom looking to emulate the late great Seve Ballesteros. Photo, www.golfbittermas.com Rom indicated he will assess his race to Dubai standing following next month's WGC, HSBC Champions event in Shanghai, before committing to either of the closing three Rolex Series events. Rahm indicated he would certainly contest three race to Dubai events in succession Italian Open, October 11-15 and Alusha Valderrama Masters, October 19-22 WGC, HSBC Champions, October 26-29 So, depending on his monolist standing following the trio of events he will decide if he will come to the closing three and they include November 2nd to 5th Turkish Airlines Open, November 9th to 12th Ned Bank Golf Challenge, and the CSUN ending November 16th to 19th DP World Tour Championship. The Spanish sensation, who only turned pro in June 2016, enters this week's PGA Tour CSUN ending Tour Championship lying fifth on the FedEx Cup standings and in position to become only the second European since Henrik Stenson in 2013 to win the Tour Championship FedEx Cup and race to Dubai victory double. If successful, Ron would pock dollar US 1.5 meters in winning the Tour Championship and an additional dollar US 10 meters as the FedEx Cup winner. And Ron, who is also the highest ranked European on the world ranking at number 5, was quizzed if he could recall what he may have been doing 12 months ago. I was watching it on TV I remember, yeah. I remember watching the whole final round and see how everything happened, he said. But I mean once I got my tour membership, one of the goals for the whole year that I set up was making it to the tour championship. I knew there weren't many rookies up until this year that had made it. To this year, I mean there were like nine, and there's what, two, three, four of us that have made it this year as rookies, so that's really impressive honestly. You know. Whatever I've been able to accomplish on the way, to add up to what I've done, and just making it here obviously for anybody I think it's a good accomplishment. It shows you've played really good golf all year long, and you have the prize to play one more week. And if you play good, hopefully and with a pretty sweet trophy or two trophies, if you're lucky enough, 